Hello everyone, this is Rashida. Welcome to my channel. My today's video is going to be on another feature selection method. And the name of today's method is select k-based method. In my last video, I talked about feature selection using correlation matrix. If you're interested, I have the link in the description box. Please check. And I am going to use the same data set as I used in my last video. So first import pandas as pd and then df pd.read csv and this is the data set housing one.csv see this is our data set so we have all these features let's see the name of the columns df.columns that gives you the name of the columns and now let's dive into the select k best method for this method we need to define the training features and target variable let's assume the price is our target variable and rest of them are the training features okay so this is the training features x df dot drop i'm going to drop this unnamed zero you see this this is nothing it's only the row number and the price is our target variable so price cannot be in our training feature so i am dropping these two unnamed zero and price and then rest of them are our training features and our target variable y is df.price. Let's go to the feature selection now. At the moment, here I am taking all the features available. Now I will use the select k best method to figure out which ones are actually the best for us. So, first import select k best from sklearn.feature selection. We also need to import f regression from same sklearn.feature selection. Now, what is f regression? Let's check. This is the documentation of scikit-learn library for select k-based method. And here you see the parameters, the score func and k. And for score func, the default is f plus 6. And let's see, there are other score funcs as well. f plus 6 is ANOVA f value between label feature of classification tasks. So the default f plus 6 can be used for classification only. So this is also another for classification. Chi-square is also for classification tasks. So I chose F regression. This is for regression tasks. And it uses F value between level and feature. If you are not too familiar with F value and want to learn very details on that, I have a link in the description box below where you will find a detailed tutorial on that. But in this video, I will only show you how to use this F regression, which is pretty simple. See, so here I'm calling select K best method and passing the score func F regression that we just saw. And K is eight. This eight means we are asking select K best to find out the top best or best eight features for us and then u fit x and y that we just defined here so you put x and y to the k best and then it's done now let's find out the name of the features here it is x dot columns x is this one so x dot columns fit this fit dot get support in this is equals to true dot to list we want to get the features as a list so these are the name of the features top eight features from select k best method using f regression as the score function all right so we saw several methods here right let's try another one what about this mutual info regression you see the same process exactly same process first you need to import mutual info regression from sklearn.feature selection and then again you call select k best pass score funk as mutual info regression and we want to get eight top features again now i am calling it fit one so chi i don't know why i called it chi though please find a better name for these variables chi dot fit x y I'm getting the name of the features using this exact same method, x.columns. This time I'm using this fit one. So fit one dot get support in this as equals to true the two list. And then you get this top eight features. 
that's all for today i hope this video was useful for you if you like this video please like comment share and subscribe thank you so much for watching